Hello, um, Mark Farina here, and uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about a show I'm having with at the Art Association, Carmel Art Association, with uh, Aaron Geffel. It's uh, called a showcase, and um, we uh, split a wall. Um, I have about uh, a dozen paintings and she has um, about the same amount. Uh, and this show is called, it's all about the sunflower. Um, and this was sort of a spur of the moment um, idea that I had. Um, uh, I inquired at the Art Association if there was a spot available for a showcase. And uh, they said uh, April was available. Uh, this was only a last month. So, uh, but they, I, they told me I had to um, get somebody to share the wall with me uh, because there's, they were required two artists to share um, the showcase wall. So I uh, asked, the, uh, emailed a few artists and Aaron was the first to respond. Um, and uh, so we sort of put this thing together uh, fairly quickly. And I, I had in mind doing a still life show, but uh, the uh, situation in the Ukraine uh, was I was I've I've been following it, um, and it was um, sort of on the forefront of uh, my mind. Um, so uh, the sunflower is actually the national flower of of Ukraine. So, um, and I had uh, quite a few sunflower still lifes in my studio. So. I thought that would go hand in hand with uh, the uh, uh, idea of the, sh the sh uh, still life show of sunflowers. So Aaron um, really didn't have any paintings of sunflowers. And boy, she uh, cranked out about a, a dozen paintings. She made two posters and uh, Auctioned them off. Um, and she's she's raised about twenty five thousand dollars for humanitarian aid. Um, she has a relative up in uh, Berkeley who runs a uh, charitable kitchen, food kitchen. So uh, she really uh, uh, did a, a fantastic job raising all this money. And uh, uh, any sales that I have, uh, she's donating uh, sales from the, the show too. And any sales that I have, I'll uh, donate a portion of my proceeds from the show. So um, let me just give you a, a little quick, tour of the show. Um, this is um, the first panel you see when you walk into the Art Association, that's Aaron's. And she's named all these little uh, still lifes for uh, people or cities that uh, have been in the news.
So I, I think most of these are available uh, still. I, and you can probably uh, buy her poster. They're a hundred dollars each. If you uh, Google uh, Aaron Gaffel, and uh, I, I, I don't know if she has any more posters left, but um, if you're interested, you can contact her. Now here here are my paintings, and I'll I'll give you um, a little explanation about each painting uh, after I finish this video. These are paintings I've done over the span of the last 20 years. Um, so they're, uh, I've just accumulated a lot of uh, sunflower still life paintings. And there's some plein air paintings too. This one's uh, the last two have been plein air. And then I have um, a few watercolors um, included. So I'll um, go through the paintings. Um, with you. Um, and let's, see, let's get this over here. Uh, this was my feature piece that was uh, on the front wall, but it, it has sold since the show opened. So it's, it's no longer on the, uh, on the wall. Uh, and I titled this one, Sunflowers for You. Um, I really am proud of this painting. It, it, uh, it was a, Again, a, a still life, mainly for a demo uh, in one of my classes that I teach. Most of these are class uh, demos. Uh, and I'll start as a demo and finish them up uh, a little bit later. Uh, this one is uh, sunflowers and squash. Uh, and it's in a, a very uh, elaborate frame from uh, Masterworks frames. And you, if you don't like the frames, we can switch the frames or deduct them. This is another uh, Masterworks frame. Uh, this is sunflowers and persimmons. Some sunflowers and red pears. <laughs> Uh, this painting I did uh, in an event, a virtual event for the Oil Painters of America. Um, it was a one day paint out uh, virtually held over the over Zoom. Uh, and there, there are people from all over uh, the world, uh, actually. There's a, a guy from South America and a couple from England and Ireland. 
um, Canada, and it was um, it was an interesting event. It was on uh, Oil Painters of America. It's probably still on Facebook. You can, um, and they went around and talked to each artist uh, over Zoom. Uh, this is another class demo. Red, yellow, red, red, yellow, blue. It's called uh, 16 by 20. Another little class demo. Uh, this was a uh, started on location. This is out at Earthbound Farms, which they always have sunflowers out there in season. And uh, this was up against one of the ridges, uh, Carmel Valley, weeping sunflowers, 20 by 16. This was a um, fairly older painting and a little oil, eight by 10, uh, before they remodeled the farm stand. I liked it better before they remodeled it. Uh, this is a plain era painting. Um, that's pretty recent, uh, maybe 2019, 18. Um, it's actually a John Deere tractor, but I, I went ahead and painted it red uh, just so it kind of pop artistic license. This is an older watercolor. Um, when I was teaching for the Carmel Adult School um, about 20 years ago, um, and this, um, this is a watercolor uh, done on location, started on location. Another watercolor. Um, they used to have this old Model T truck out front, uh, and they would have a display flowers on it. Um, somebody thought they had their car in reverse, and it was actually in forward, and they they took out the Model T, and uh, it was never to be seen again. And uh, that's one of the flower pickers out there. This is a little more recent um, painting, uh, a demo for a private lesson and uh, came out nice and loose. Um, I think it's a 20 by 16 with a mat included. So very, very cheerful uh, painting. So that's um, that's about it. Uh, this is a, another still life. So if you the show runs until May fourth, um, but the paintings are will be available uh, for a few months, and you can. Contact the Art Association if you're interested, and in, uh, part of the proceeds will go to a humanitarian cause. Uh, I think uh, I, I'll choose Mercy Corps. They they do uh, uh, world humanitarian aid. So, all right. Thank you for watching. Bye.